Let's make faces by Hannah Piven. Today we're going to be finding faces in the most unexpected of places. All these faces are made out of everyday objects. That means you're going to find them around your house, in the world around you. It's all about creativity and imagination. There are so many faces to discover in our world. All you have to do is look. Is a button just a button, or is it an eye? Making faces is fun, but where do we start? First, let's find some. The world is filled with faces waiting to be discovered. Have a look at these everyday objects. Can you spot the faces? Are they happy faces? Are they sad faces? Are they shocked faces? You decide. Now look carefully at these fruits and vegetables. What more can you see? I see faces. Now, if you look at these tools from the garage, what do you spot? I see faces too. When you go out to the garden, take a close look. What can you spot? You'll meet new friends. Now that we've found faces, we're ready to make faces. Let's gather more stuff. You're going to need to look around the house to find things that could make eyes, or noses, and mouths. Let's make faces. A happy face. A sad face. A goofy face. A monster face, <gasps> a scared face, a mummy face, a daddy face, oh, a sleepy face, and a <gasps> snoring face, a party face. Now it's your turn. Let's make faces. Try to find these objects in your house and see how many different faces you can make with them. How to make faces? One, more is more. Gather as many things as you can. It will help you find the right combination. Let go. Don't worry if you don't have an idea. As you start working, you're going to start getting ideas. Look carefully and observe. Let the materials guide you. They'll tell you what they want to become. Watch out for. All the happy mistakes. Lots of good ideas happen by chance. Look out for them. Trial and error is good. The more possible combinations of objects you try, the better the chances of creating something great. Rome wasn't built in a day, so don't worry if at the beginning your face isn't coming together. It's normal. Stay with it. It will improve. Play, play, play. Playing is part of being an artist. The more playing you do, the freer you become, and the more ideas will come to you. Oh, and remember, have fun.